Hello and welcome to the quick upper body workout with hand weights with me Charlotte Russell. So if you haven't got a pair of hand weights don't worry you can make your own. So I think the best way is to just use two recyclable water bottles you know the ones you get for a quid. Just fill them up with water <laughs> um, or soil. Two tins of beans as long as they're the same size. Um, just make sure they're the same shape, same size, same weight. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's get to it. So, find yourself a chair. Make sure it's a chair that you're not going to sink into, so the sofa's no good. I'm using this stool, feet about hip width, sitting tall, tummy tight, a weight in each hand. Just rest your hands on your thighs, and we're just going to circle the shoulders backwards. If you're using heavy weights, be careful. You want to make sure that you're nice and warm first. Don't just do it straight from cold. So just give your arms a little bit of a shake out first. Take the arms by your side. Keep the shoulders back and down. Turn the palms towards the screen. Elbows tucked in close to your body. Let's start with bicep curls. So keep the tummy in, sit tall, nice and slowly. Make sure you're not bending your wrists as you bring the lower arm up towards your shoulder. Keep them nice and straight, hands in line with your lower arm. Also, don't grip your weights too tightly. Let's go twice as quickly. Here we go, it's up and down. Try not to just flop down like that, control. Keep those elbows tucked in, close to your body. So it's only the lower arm that's moving. Make sure you're not shrugging the shoulders to help you. Four slow ones, tummy tight, sit tall. Holding the weights firmly, but not too tightly. You don't want to waste your energy here. Breathe with the move. Last one. Lovely. Turn the palms to face your body. Let's go up out wide and down. So palms facing you, facing your body as you come down. Just to shoulder height. Again, sit tall. Wrists are straight. Don't flop them like that. No floppy wrists. Controlling the move as you bring it down. Feel free to bend the elbows, but just don't shrug the shoulders. Keep the shoulders back and down. Sit tall. Breathe. Let's go twice as quickly. Here we go. It's up and down. Now this is fast. It's hard to control. It's hard just not to flop down. Try your best. Four more. Three. Two. Last one. Keeping the palms facing your body. Lift in front and lower, sitting tall, shoulders down. Making sure your upper body isn't rocking backwards and forwards as you lift those arms. Use your abdominal muscles as well. Four more to go, let's bring it up and control it on the way down, bring it up. Good, sitting tall, keep those shoulders down. Keep those wrists straight. All right, twice as quickly, this time, here we go, it's up. And down. Again, controlling it on the way down, trying not to let your body swing. Four more. Trying to stay in time with the music, but don't worry if you're a little bit behind. Good. Now keeping the arms down, but then press behind, lift the arms behind the body and try and bring them towards each other around the back. Make sure you're not shrugging your shoulders, palms face each other and don't bend your wrists. Keep the hands in line with the, with the arm. Good. Sitting tall, squeeze, working your triceps. Good. Breathe with the move. And again, last one at this pace. Now let's go twice as fast, but this time it's three, two, one. Keep those wrists straight. Three, two, one. Make sure you're not leaning forward. Three, two, one. Nice. Tummy in tight. You've got four more to go. Can you lift a little higher and press a little closer? As you bring it down again, don't flop it. Control. Try and resist gravity. Two more. One more time. Well done. Turn the palms to face the front and let's go for bicep curls again. Just to stretch out the triceps. Elbows close to your side. Wrists are straight. Sitting tall. One more to go. Very nice. Rest the hands, rest the weights, and walk the feet out. 
and come forwards just a tiny little bit and lean forwards ever so slightly. Make sure you don't jut your chin forwards, shoulders back and down and tummy muscles pulled in tight, knees and toes turn outwards. So we're going to raise the elbows higher than your shoulders if possible, keeping your shoulders down, palms face your chest and keep those arms straight, don't bend your wrists. Let's keep it going, so upright row, elbows higher than your shoulders if possible. Make sure you're not shrugging your shoulders or gripping your weights too tightly. Keep the tummy muscles tight, lead with the elbows, twice as fast, we're going up and down, up and down. Control it on the way down, don't just let it flop. Keep it going, three more. Nice and smooth, tummy muscles tight. Twice as slowly, watch the change. We bring it up, we push forwards, we bring it back into that position, elbows high and take it down. One more slow one. Up, push forwards, wrists are straight, twice as fast. And up, push forwards, up and down. So elbows high there and there. <clears throat> I've got a bit of a frog in my throat. And again, keep the abs in tight. Remember, don't jut your chin forward. You've got four more to go. Keep it smooth, as if you're doing it through water, so don't fling it. Always very controlled. Two more. Try not to shrug the shoulders. Last one, but we're gonna bring it up again and stick with the chest presses. So we're coming up and forwards. And forwards. Good. Keep those elbows up at the same height as your shoulders. Last one. Good, bring it in, drop the elbows, push it up and down. Bring your body upright now. Shoulder presses, try not to grip the weights too tightly. And when you raise those arms, don't shrug your shoulders. Eight more to go. Eight, seven, it's six. Sit tall, tummy tight. Four more, three, two, well done. Now take the elbows to shoulder height, lean forwards a little bit, keep the shoulders back and down. Bring the arms forward, turn the palms towards each other, tummy tight. We're going to go for three presses behind the body. Three, two, one. Don't jut your chin forwards. Remember, you are leaning forwards from the hips just a little bit. Keep the abs in to support your body. Working the backs of the arms and the upper back, trying to squeeze your shoulder blades towards each other. Don't fling it, you've got four more. Don't grip those weights too tightly. Try not to clench your thighs, keep your legs nice and relaxed. Shoulders back and down. Four, two more to go, sorry. Last one, three, two, one. Well done, bring it back in and lower it down and zigzag the feet in. Well done, very good. Roll those shoulders back and down. Excellent work. Let's put the weights on the floor. Use your tummy muscles and come back up. Let's take a shake, shake it up and shake it down. And again, shake it up and shake it down. One more time. A few little stretches now. Take your right arm out, bring it across and just press gently. Stretching into that shoulder here. Sit tall and breathe. Change sides. So, make sure you don't bring your shoulder across. You keep your shoulder back and down. Breathe. Lovely. Very nice. Let's place the hands in the small of the back. Sit tall, tummy tight and squeeze the shoulder blades together. Just stretching out your chest there. Lovely. And release. Take your arms out wide, thumbs down and just press behind. Downwards and behind with those thumbs. Just opening out around your chest a little bit. Roll the shoulders back. Keeping the shoulders down, take your right arm up and behind, just stretching into your triceps. See how far you can walk your fingers down your spine. Keep your chin up, so feel the stretch. Help it along with your left if you want to. And then change sides. So see how far you can get that left arm to go down your spine. Keep your chin up. Use your right to help if you want to. Lovely. And let's just stretch out the upper back. So if you lace the fingers, turn the palms towards the knee, tummy muscles tight and just sink into that spine, letting the shoulders come forwards, chin towards your chest, just stretching through the upper back. 
Breathe and keep your abs in. Now release the fingers, turn the palms towards you. Use your tummy muscles to help you sit tall. Roll the shoulders back and down. Lovely, well done. That's the end of your workout. Next time, maybe you could use heavier weights or if you didn't use weights, see if you can use some weights for the next one. But build it up gradually, okay? See you soon. Thanks for joining me.